Welcome to Catherine the Paint. Today we are going to do a bloom um, swipe on the spinner, but on these little bitty two inch square little canvases, they have a magnet on the back. And I got a set of three, so um, I got these for Christmas from my one of my wonderful nieces and had not tried them yet. So I saw them in there this morning. I was like, oh no, I wanna use those. So what am I gonna do? So. I think I am going to, of course, put the pillow paint down and then run the color across all three and then swipe it like that. So, and hopefully they will look good together and separately. So that is what we are going to do. All right, so I'm just gonna put some pillow paint down on each one. They're so small, I don't want it to be overwhelmed. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, just trying to spread it out a little bit. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm gonna put the, I'm putting the color all the way across here, so. Yeah, it needs to be. Forgot about that. Guys, I am so excited. Y'all are awesome. I have over a thousand subscribers now, so I am going to be doing my thousand subscriber giveaway this week. So probably tomorrow or the next day. So excited. Can't believe you guys. Y'all are amazing. Okay, I think that's good. Okay. <clears throat> All right, for my colors, I am using a bunch of colors I already had made up. So I've got this really pretty um, bronze color. It's a metallic from Folk Art. Then I've got the gold. It's also a metallic from Folk Art. And then I have... Uh, I don't remember the name of this one. Hold on. All right. Well, this one's magenta from Liquitex Basics. And this is turquoise from Liquitex Basics. <laughs> and let me look up that primary element one. Hold on just a second. Okay. Yeah. It's the pink anthurium. I do not know why I cannot ever remember that. Pink anthurium. Pink anthurium. All right. So... I'm going to try to do a kind of thin line. I got kind of crazy the last time I did a um, swipe and just put down a ton of paint. It looks really pretty, but these are tiny, so I don't want too much paint on them. I think this is going to look great with these colors. bit of gold. I'm actually not going to put it all the way across. Just a little. All right. Magenta. Again, I don't want too much of this, I think, because we've got the pink anthurium. Okay, just clump it on there. No big deal. <laughs> all right.
Now we're going to put the topper on. I kind of do want this all the way across because that is the magic stuff right here. All right. All right, I am going to use these little quarter sheet um, paper towels and <laughs> not wet them. I'm just going to kind of put it on there, make sure it's touching. turn it around and do it on the other use the other edge and overlap just a little bit okay yeah it's the oven I'm trying to cook hmm I'm gonna put a little bit more topper down I'm not getting a whole lot of bubbles over here or lacing hmm Okay, I'm going to touch up a few places, like right here. have to play with this for a minute because it is not exactly the way I wanted it. Hmm. All right, hopefully that'll do it. Bubble right there. I am going to let these sit for a few minutes and see if they develop. If they don't, then I may scrape them off and try again. Let's just kind of see. Oh, uh, we were supposed to spin this out, weren't we? Hmm. Maybe we'll spin it a little bit. How about that? See what happens. They are developing. This one's kind of lame, but the red, both these two look pretty good. Let's just spin a little bit more and then let it develop. Sometimes I get so impatient with the swipe one. All right, I'm gonna leave it and I'll be back in a few minutes. Okay, I have waited a few minutes and this one is still really sad. So I'm gonna put a little more paint on it and swipe it again because I want all three of them to not be sad. <laughs> so let's just try it again. Hopefully, 
This one will bring it up to code. Now we are going to add a little bit of gold, not much. Okay, and the topper, which I have contaminated with the other thing, but it's all right, we'll make a new one. side right we have a new family moving in across the street <laughs> so there's trucks and moving trucks and little kids singing so that's cool all right, now we are going to let this one sit for a little while. Get the bubble. All right, let's see how it does. I'll be back. All right, let's check out the dried results of these little babies. <laughs> That's the far right one. This is the middle one. And here's the left one. Lots of cell action. Loving the colors. Like them individually and together. How fun are they? Alright guys, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Be inspired.